What's up guys? And uh, check out my screen right now so you are probably very very familiar that this is Pokemon Go. The game that has taken the world by storm and it's really popular, the music is very epic as well, let me turn it down because you can't hear me. Actually we can but you know the music is too loud. And uh, so this game has taken the world by storm, it's very popular. Uh, almost everyone is playing it, I'm playing it too, it's very cool but I decided that I should do a review on the game and recommend it to you in case you haven't heard of it although you know the majority of the people have and um, anyway I'm gonna do a review on this game and show you a little bit of gameplay so um, Pokemon Go first of all if you don't know the idea it is a GPS based game, so as, as you can see, this is the map, and um, when I walk, when I actually walk in real life, my avatar is going is going to walk. Is obviously, I can't show it to you right now because I'm sitting on my desk recording, and if I tap, it will not walk, but uh, if I walk in real life, it's actually gonna walk on the map, so... The point of the game is to walk, uh, catch Pokemon while you are walking, uh, evolve them, train them, battle at gyms and so on. And uh, gyms are actually places in real life that are like uh, churches or monuments. And you also have Pokestops, which are also monuments. And you can see Pokestops by, you know, these uh, blue cubes. These are the Pokestops. And if, if I tap on it, if I can, as you can see, this is um, this is a monument in my town, and um, I'm actually too far away from it right now, so I can't uh, collect it. But um, if you are close to Pokestops, you can actually collect Pokeballs, potions, and other bonuses for your Pokémon um, uh, by just uh, spinning the picture right there. By just going to the Pokestop, opening it and spinning the picture, you can um, you can uh, actually collect Pokeballs, potions and other bonuses which will help you play the game. And uh, you can also get these bonuses right here in the shop, but uh, they cost these uh, Pokecoins which uh, you buy with real money. So if you don't want to pay real money for this game, just go to Pokestops in your town and collect all these bonuses. You also get uh, these things that you see in the shop for leveling up. So you can get them by leveling up. And uh, you level up by collecting different Pokemon, uh, by going to different Pokestops, it gives you experience and so on. So this is Pokemon Go, it's a very popular game and it's really good, it's amazing, I really love it. Uh, many people are playing it, I am too. If you haven't heard of it, definitely check it out. It's awesome on the App Store, it's free. And um, also, uh, here, um, as you can see, uh, Pokemon showed up on the Poké uh, Raider. So, on this Raider right here, you can see the nearby Pokemon, and by going um, in, by walking in real life, you can get closer to them and catch them, and yeah. Just like this so so one more thing guys about the items in the shop so uh, these pocky coins I told you that you can buy them with real money but you can actually earn them if you capture a gym if uh, if you capture a gym and um, you actually get uh, you actually defeat somebody after you capture the gym you get uh, pocky coins for that uh, for 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 your win so if you if someone tries to capture the gym from you and you defeat them, you actually get Poké coins from that. And uh, yeah, so this is how you get Poké coins um, if you don't want to purchase them with real money. So just keep in mind, guys, that um, when you capture a gym and some somebody battles you, you are not gonna battle them in real time. Um, actually an AI is gonna battle them so it's not gonna be you so just keep that in mind that uh, if an AI is controlling your actions uh, you may not win because you know you, you may be smarter than the AI who knows so 
Yeah, just keep that in mind that uh, an AI or a robot is controlling your actions when you actually when somebody actually tries to capture your gym so it's not gonna be a real-time battle uh, somebody will try to capture the gym and you see the you you see the results afterwards so just keep that in mind and uh, this is pretty much all for Pokemon Go this is the basics of the game and you know uh, go go out and play that game it's amazing I do recommend it and um, so now because I can't show you any gameplay right now because I'm in my house I'm not working I'm gonna show you a few evolutions uh, so you can see how evolutions of Pokemon uh, happen and before saying that I actually have to explain that um, you evolve your Pokemon by capturing uh, the same Pokemon so for example if I want to evolve my Growlithe I have to capture uh, more Growlithe so as you can see I have 19 of those candy and for evolution um, I need 50 so if I want to collect 50 candies I have to catch more Growlithe and uh, for every Growlithe I think it gives I think I'm not sure it gives you 3 candies so if I want to evolve my Growlithe I need about uh, 20 more Growlithe and um, you also power up your Pokemon by using those candy and um, you know you acquire this candy it's different for every Pokemon and you acquire this candy by capturing the same Pokemon and uh, if you want to acquire this candy without capturing the same Pokemon you can actually transfer your Pokemon and it's gonna give you one candy uh, for this Pokemon so if I actually transfer my Golden to the Professor it will give me one Golden candy and this Golden will disappear from my collection and um, this is how you get candy, evolve your Pokemon and power them up and my, some of my Pokemon are actually dead because I had a gym battle recently and uh, I haven't revived them but you can actually re revive them by using revives and potions yeah and uh, so that's it so let me show you some evolutions now so this is my Caterpie evolving and uh, just keep that in mind that um, in these videos that you see the evolutions these videos are recorded before the, begin before the beginning of the video so in the beginning of the video you will see different Pokemon than you see now because these videos with the evolutions are recorded before so just keep that in mind and I'm currently doing a voiceover so that's why I don't have my uh, Pidgeot here and I have it in the beginning of the video and you're gonna see the evolution from Pidgeot to Pidgeot right now. So guys, this is Pokemon Go, it's an epic game, definitely try it out, I do recommend it and um, sorry I wasn't able to explain all the items in the game but there are a lot of items and you will actually, uh, you will, you will um, learn about those items as you play the game. When you get an item in, 